Ney is probably one of the, or the oldest uh, instruments in the world, and it's the simplest instrument. It's made of uh, reed. Uh, different parts of Middle East uh, play Ney, but with uh, very different styles. Uh, other than uh, Iran, Ney is basically played uh, by putting the uh, instrument next to your lips and mainly making two uh, levels of, uh, I don't think this is on, uh, uh, sound uh, with a limited uh, range. Uh, in Iran, uh, about uh, 100 or so years ago, uh, a musician discovered a new way or a different way of uh, playing nay which is uh, putting the nay between the two front teeth, just a little bit of it, and make a different sound in addition to the other sounds that uh, uh, other cultures make with nay. Uh, nay has no mouthpiece whatsoever, it's just a plain uh, tube. And uh, in Iran we call it half band, which is seven uh, sections basically. And uh, it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pieces and the length uh, goes from a l longer length gradually to the uh, smaller one. It has uh, six holes, five in front and uh, one in the back. And uh, you have to make uh, 17 notes that uh, make the Iranian uh, octave. There are uh, five uh, quarter notes in addition to the 12 western notes. And this is mainly made with uh, half fingering and as you will see with the uh, lips and the uh, uh, gestures on, on the face. So uh, once I played for my uh, daughter's uh, school, elementary school, and uh, kids started laughing because they had never seen anyone do that to his best. <laughs> so <laughs> from then on, uh, when I played for the kids, I used to uh, turn the lights off and uh, then they liked it.
Dr. Sheikh al Islami. Uh, before we begin uh, with uh, Dr. Sirish's lecture, just a couple announcements. Um, I'm going to pass around a, um, a handout. It's from Reynold Nicholson's translation of Masnavi or Mathnavi into English. And um, also, we have a